Okay. Right, what I'm going to do now is build a two hook place trace. I use 0.45 line, this is clear line, it's about 25-30 pound line. Right, and I'm going to tie that using a four turn water knot. So I create a big bow of line, take the end, four turns round my fingers, my two fingers, then over and take the bow back through. Pull it through once and then open up and pull it through. Tighten it up so now we've got the loose end and a big loop of line. What I'm going to do is cut the loose end. This is the first small snood there. Cut that. So we've got the small snood, the long snood. And then I'm going to cut it there. Right, so this is our trace length. Tie a swivel to this end. Five turns, tuck and through. Wet it. Ease it up. Tidy up the swivel knot. Right, so that's the first. So this goes to the boom, this goes to my first hook length, and the second hook length to the end. So what I'm going to do here, the first hook length, add a couple of beads, just so a bit of attraction for it. Yellow. Any colour really, to be honest. Some people think it matters. Sometimes it probably does, but there we are, a couple of beads. And right, today we're after big place, so I'm going to use a size 2.0 Camasan hook. Same knot as the swivel, five turns and through. Trim it up. Right. So we've got the swivel, the first hook length. And I'm going to do the same for the end of the line. Add the other hook on. A couple of beads, a couple of random coloured beads. Don't really need to go too, too much into it. There we are. That'll do. Tie the hook on. Sometimes it works to add 10, 20, 30 beads. But today, um, what I'm going to do now is fish anchor. Um, so really, it's more about the scent than the visual attraction. If I was going to drift, trying to attract the fish, then more beads. Okay, that's that. Okay, nice big ragworm. Straight through the... <laughs> the dog wants it. Straight through the, the head or the mouth. Thread it up. Thread it up the hook. If you can see that, it's threading up, 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 up. Thread it all the way up. Right, there we are. And then this bit, I'm going to tip with squid. There we are. That's a big bait for a big, big place. Right, on the end hook, on the end, I'm just going to add the worm. Same thing, thread it up. Ease it up, thread it up, ease it up, and there we are, and that's the other one. There we are, so now I've got the two worm baits, okay, and there we are. 